in this video, I'll be going over how to make money off the Robinhood app. But before I get into the video, if you haven't checked out my channel before, I talk about investing, I talk about the stock market, and I use the Robinhood app often on my channel. So if you're interested in anything like that, definitely head over to my channel, Investing Potentials, and consider subscribing. But other than that, getting right into the video, as you can see here, I'm showing you my screen where I have pulled up the Robinhood app, and I am on iPhone right now, but that's not really important. So the three ways to make money off of the Robinhood app that I can really think of are by either getting dividend returns, which is when a stock pretty much just basically pays you a certain amount of money, either quarterly, so four times a year, um, some do it annually, only once a year, and then really the only other way most companies pay out dividends are monthly dividends, which you get one every single month, but the most common way is quarterly, second most common way is monthly. So that's one way that you can get money off the Robinhood app or make money off the Robinhood app, which would just be buying a stock and getting dividends. The next way would be getting actual capital gains. Like as you can see here, the past week I made $86. Past month I made $239. And past three months I made $555. So it would be just simply getting those gains off of stocks that grew in valuation. And then the third way would be through the Robinhood Rewards Program. And um, if just this free stock, basically you share your code. I have one in the link of every video or in the description of every video that I post. And this is just a way of Robinhood basically trying to get more people to go to the stock. So I'm going to go over each of these ways a little bit more in depth one by one. And the first one I'm going to go over is dividends. So with dividends, what you have to do is buy a stock before their ex dividend date. And you could just simply look that up. A great resource that I use for Dividend stocks is dividendchannel.com. It shows you pretty much all the information you would need to know about a stock's dividend. But you can look at some of that info right on the Robinhood app. Like, for example, it shows the dividend yield right there. But one thing you would want to look up is when the ex dividend date is and when the payout date is. Those are two important numbers. So, as you can see right here, the payout date for Microsoft this past year was June 8th, September 14th, and December 14th. And I did not own it early enough to get the very first dividend date. So, they pay out um, dividend four times a year. So, that'd be a quarterly dividend. And one thing, like I said, you would like to look up if you're interested in that is the ex dividend date. So, that you have to buy the stock before this date in order to get the dividend for the next payout. So, for example, let's say. Um, the next dividend is going to be paid out, I don't know, February 2nd for Microsoft. Then let's say I had to pay it, buy it before January 29th. So you would have to, the, the ex dividend date would be the 29th, and that payout date would be the 2nd. So you'd have to buy it before that date. And dividends on the Robinhood app just simply get deposited into your buying power. They don't get put back into the stock or anything like that. Robinhood does not have a drip program or a dividend reinvestment program, which I hope they add in the near future. And another way that you make money off the Robinhood app is through capital gains. Oh, wait, actually, before I get into that, I'm just going to show you monthly dividend stock to show you that there are some on the Robinhood app. As you can see right here, I've been receiving those dividends every single month. That's a little bit different. But anyways, um, how you can also make money off the Robinhood app is through capital gains. And I'll show you that. So as you can see right here, I'm currently up $20 on Microsoft and I am up 30%. But because I haven't sold this stock yet, I still own it. I technically don't have that money back or those gains back. It's still in my portfolio invested. But if I were to sell Microsoft, which I'm not going to do because I want to keep it, um, then I would get the 68 plus that additional $20 if I were to sell it at this current market price. Now, I'm more of a long-term investor, but what you can do is sell penny stocks or sell other stocks swing or day trade and then you'd be able to get those gains right away but i am not too worried about that i am just simply worried about or not worried about i am more of a long-term investor and plan to increase my portfolio in the long term rather than the short term so for example let's say this penny stock right here let's say you bought it last week at right around 92 cents and then you sold it this week at you know a dollar you would make an eight cent return and if you sold it right away, if you did a swing trade with it or a day trade with it, then you would get those returns quickly rather than waiting the long term. But I prefer waiting the long term and trying to grow the buy portfolio in value over years and years rather than only a couple of days. But really, that's up to you how you want to invest. And then 
getting into the last way on how to make money is through this rewards program that Robinhood's offering. I get quite a few. Um, I'm not going to go into my past invites or show you how many I've gotten because it shows people's names that have done them or have um, accepted the link and I don't want to like show their name without their consent or anything like that. I'm sure they wouldn't really mind too much. But um, basically with this rewards program, all you do is you share the link right here, which is my which I just copied it to the key or copied it to my clipboard. So you share that link and when people choose that link and sign up with the Robinhood app, they get a free stock and you get a free stock as well. And there's a variety of different stocks you can get. Um, as you can see right here, one in 150 of getting Microsoft, Apple, Facebook, one in 150, Ford, Snap, or AMD, and a 100% chance of getting a free share. Now, Apple, Microsoft, Facebook, I have all of them on my portfolio. Facebook's around $180, Microsoft around 80 and Apple around the same as Facebook. So you have a very, very slim chance of getting them. I have yet to get them. I have seen other people get them, though. And then Ford, Snap, or AMD, uh, those stocks are right around the $10 to $20 range. They kind of move up and down quite a bit, especially Snapchat and AMD. But um, those, I have gotten one Ford stock, I believe, and I haven't gotten any of the other ones. But you mainly just get penny stocks or stocks that are under five or six dollars. Um, for example, I got Groupon on one of them. I have uh, Zynga on one of them, and I've also gotten uh, Sirius XM on quite a few of them as well. Because as you can see right here, it says my total returns over 100%. But that is just because I keep getting them on the rewards. But that is okay with me. I think I can actually go over here to show you some of them that I've gotten on the rewards. Oh yes, I can. So as you can see right here, if you go to um, this little side tab over here go to history filter switch it to rewards you can see your rewards and as you can see I've gotten quite a few and they actually don't update this for whatever reason I don't know if it's a glitch or something like that I have actually gotten more than this but for whatever reason they don't show every single one over here I'm not 100% sure why and I haven't contacted Robinhood about it yet um, one because it's not really a big deal to me I don't really care that much but and you can also look at your dividends orders or your dividends over here as well if you're interested in looking at that. And as you can see, I have gotten quite a few dividends over the time I've been investing. But anyways, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope it was informative. Um, so basically the three ways to make money off the Robinhood app are either by getting capital gains, dividend returns, or through their rewards slash referral program. But if you enjoyed the video, definitely hit that like button. And as I said before, if you haven't checked out my channel before, I talk about investing, I talk about the stock market, really anything that has to do with money. So if you're interested in anything like that, definitely consider heading over to my channel, Investing Potentials, and consider subscribing. But other than that, guys, thanks for watching.